Hi, I'm Sarita. I live in my 2016 Ram ProMaster 2500. I'm here at Consumers River Farm in Galt, California. I booked an overnight stay here using my Harvest Host membership. And let me show you how it went. I was pleasantly surprised by the charm of this small family winery. Judy, the hostess, was more than happy to explain some wine basics to me. Um, different regions can call it different things if it's from France, and they do method champenois, that is a uh, double fermentation in the bottle. This is called the Charmant method. This is a local made by Wybell uh, Family Wines here in, Lodi, in the Lodi area. Um, it, like, if you're in Spain, it would be called Cava. In Italy, it's called Prosecco, because you can't call it Champagne if it doesn't come from the Champagne region in France. Now, this one is kind of fruity a little bit. It is. So, it's a, this is actually a, a, a cuvee, and it's made with Pinot Noir grapes. That means that's where the color comes from. So, I made it to my very first Harvest Host location. This is so nice. This is um, Consumers Winery. It is amazing. So I am tasting wine. I'm not a wine person. I'm, I'm not. I'm not a sophisticated wine drinker by any means. But this right here, this is amazing. So it's a little bit fruity and it's a little sparkly, and it's actually just really, really, really good. So I'm going to order a bottle and I'm going to order some of their. Um, but they have house specialties, they do their own vinegars, they have their own oils. I tried the rosemary olive oil, it's like a blend of fusion, it is so freaking good. So I definitely am not going to leave here without something in my hands. I gotta have something to remember this place by. Um, and I am trying to get out here and learn a little bit about this beautiful place. Welcome to Consume the Super Farm. I had such a good time sampling their oil blends and vinegars, I forgot to record it, y'all. I watched the sunset amongst the grapevines and slept peacefully. The next morning was pretty chilly, so I made some tea to warm my bones. Then I made a hearty breakfast of grain-free sourdough toast, sausage, egg, oranges for vitamin C, and a little applesauce sprinkled with cinnamon. Then I washed up, dumped my trash, and headed for my next adventure, a hike at the Consumers Nature Preserve.